I'm going to show you a tool in Canva that I bet you didn't know was there. It's going to level up all of your social media posts and we're going to begin on Canva's homepage. Typically what I would tell you is to open up design, but we're actually not going to do that. We're going to use something called magic design and there's two ways to get to magic design. The first way is by actually searching magic design and click try magic design and you can insert media that way. However, the way I prefer to do it is by clicking the upload button here and starting from a file. And I'm going to choose this image right here. And this is an image that I took on my cell phone and we're going to use this image in a design. Instead of clicking use in design or edit photo, we're going to click this add to template. And what this is going to do is add the picture to a template. There are limited options right now because this is in beta, but I wanted to see what recommendations it would give me. This gives me some options and puts text, it might put elements, it might put other things in the design so that it is quicker for me to design things. Instagram post, this would be a square size. It looks like a calendar. This one is a story vertical size, so more like uh, YouTube shorts, Instagram story, Instagram reels, TikToks, that sort of thing. This is a desktop wallpaper. Let's see what else is there. We've got other stories, we've got flyers, we've got other Instagram posts. And what I love is that you can actually click category and choose something. So let's say that I know that I want to use it in an, uh, a square size, then I can click the Instagram post and it will give me all square sizes. Let's see what else we've got. I kind of like this look. But, oh, no, I like this one. I can click style here and add a vibe or a theme. So I could click vibe of, um, I think it was floral, and it gives a different look altogether. And this is just amazing. So with this one, I love this. I actually like that one a whole lot. You can actually pick styles here as well you can actually add your headline there. So you can add part of your text before you even open up the design with the image in it. We'll just say coming soon. Add to results. So then we can see coming soon on there. And I am going to use this one. This one is a Canva Pro template, but you will see that in my case, they do have some free ones that are there as well. And when I click this, it's going to say it's based on a template by this Canva creator. We're going to customize this template. And what I love about this particular template is that it actually has animations already on it. So this is a breathe animation. So you'll see there's animations there. And so I don't have to add any animations to it. And this is a great Thing. Now, I might want to change the style of this, of the text. Maybe I don't want the text to be that. So I can click over here on the left-hand side, Styles, and then I can change the style of this to include the brand font if I want, or I could change the color of things. Now, these are a little much. I think, honestly, think that what was there in the beginning worked the best, but I would go ahead and change the font because that's, I'm not a particular big fan of that font. This one's better, the catamaran bold. What about catamaran black? I like that. Now, when you have something that's got animations like this, then what you're going to want to do is share it. It depends on where you're sharing it. I would probably share this on Instagram if I'm downloading it as an MP4. 
Um, you could also share this as a GIF on your YouTube community tab. Um, by the way, GIF can be found by clicking share, download, and you just need to choose the file type. And that would be a, a moving animated image without any sound. If I decided I didn't want any of this stuff here, well, guess what? My image is right here and I could actually just design a new thing with it. If you like magic design, what you would really love is something called magic presentation. And basically it gives you a lot of ideas for a presentation and you can even use those ideas for your YouTube videos. And I'm going to put a tutorial right here on the screen. I want you to click into that. All right. I'll see you next time. Bye.